So I've been playing around and experimenting with the diatonic fourths and that whole concept and getting familiar with some of the harmonies and how they sound. So, like, I started with the minor chords for some reason. Like, if you take an A minor, that can be the, um, the sixth chord of C major, and it can be the two chord of G major, or the three chord of F major. So if you keep A as a drone, you can produce um, three different A minor substitutions there. So if you place diatonic fourths in C, so you got C, F, B, E, A, so I'm just starting from F. It's like the first, the second shape. First, you have, first I have um, C, F, so it starts from the second fourth. F, B, E, A. So that shape remains throughout. That's just like, I call it the first shape, because then you have all the other ones, you know? But anyway, um, back to this. So, in the key of C with an A on the bottom, that would be your A minor. Okay, so you're really playing um, an augmented fifth and a ninth. So, it's like minor nine, augmented five, something like that. I need to brush up on the actual terminology. Anyway, um, now if you're in the key of G, use diatonic fourths in G. Same shape, put an A there. Now you're playing an A minor from the perspective of the key of G. So now you have um, a minor third, a minor, what is that, a uh, sixth? Yeah, um, or an augmented fifth, whatever you want to call it. Um, then chord tones. So anyway, um, so that's a completely different minor chord. Now if you do from the key of F and use diatonic fourths in F, wait, I'm sorry. Yeah, right there. Now you get like a flat nine thing. And, um, and a major seventh, major seven, flat nine, something like that. Um, so you have three different A minor sounds, and they're all interchangeable. You don't have to be in, in the key of G to use this one, and in the key of C to use that one. That's what's cool. So like, even for like chord kind of stuff, you know, it has a nice, just using them back and forth. just mixing within and I also found if you use it um, the um, that one you can go like this would be the one you would use in the key of E flat something to that effect um still having a lot of fun with them so um that's it for now